welcome if you're new via here be sure to click the subscribe button and also click the bell icon so that you'll be notified about videos uploaded from this channel the topics that we'll be discussing today man slash pregnant girlfriend shows in clarendon and a soldier and 19 others arrested in Old Arbor. A man said to be a soldier was among 20 persons apprehended during a set of operation carried out by the police in Old Arbor on Friday to clamp down on persons breaching the Disaster Risk Management Act. Police said the clampdown started after 9 p.m. During the raids, the police said they also apprehended a number of persons gathered at a candlelight located in the St. Catherine Base community. Police said the persons were apprehended and later taken into custody. The police say they are no longer required to give warning notice before an arrest under the breaches of the hack. It means those in violation of the rules to prevent the spread of the virus in Jamaica can be now arrested and charged immediately. <coughs> People, if you're interested to see the full video, you don't know follow. Just go on down in the description, click the link on the down there, and go on the group and view it. The Child Protection and Family Service Agency has located the two boys seen in a recent video smoking what appears to be ganja. A team of investigators visited the community where an assignment was conducted with children and their families in identifying the most suitable intervention and continuous support that are needed. The CEO of the agency, Rosalie Gale, said that the agency is concerned about the increase of reports of incident where children are being exposed to moral danger. Children learn by the Mi'kmaq behaviors of those who are around them. We are therefore calling on the parents and guardians to ensure that their children are properly supervised at all times. By a responsible adult, she said. She added that one of the concerns from the video is the early exposure to the substance being used. We also saw a similar video last year involving a toddler who was given alcohol and cigarettes. As a country, we must come to a point of realizing that these matters are not a joke and can lead to possible addiction at an early age. A man accused of killing his pregnant girlfriend was rescued from an angry residence by police a short while ago. The incident took place in Clarendon, the woman has been identified as Tashika McKay. Via some subscribers, it has been reported that a man allegedly killed his girlfriend who was eight months pregnant. Words in the street is that the young lady family members went to visit her this morning because them na see her and them normally see her early throughout the day. When the family member them reach the house, them see her on the ground with multiple stab wounds to the chest area and her throat slash. They went ahead to inform the police, but by the time the police for reach, the residents of the community already had tried to get to the man for beating. The police them come and me tell your people it is a struggle for try to get out the man because the people them decide say if he's even a busted, him off he left there with a busted. Them decide say they want to beat him, they want to dirt him, they want to dash him away. It gets to the extent to where the police them even a fire fire shots for back off the people them and even when the police a fire shot, the people them still a go off of him. <laughs> A lot more video there. De. So you see if you're interested for see the video them from all different angle, all you have to do guys are go down in the description of this video where you will see a link to the Chop City Telegram group. Just click on the link, you automatically join the group and the videos have already been sent to the group. People, I need you for see this. I need you opinion. So you see, if you don't know of go down in the description, just run on over to the Instagram page at Chop City TV. That is C H O P C I T U I underscore TV. Send me a message asking for the link and it will be provided to you as soon as possible. As you can see in a little sneak peek, the Momoguno, the whole community come out for that one. Yeah. Everybody come out, it upset everybody's spirit. Me and I know the young lady and me I tell you some jerk up by it. Because how can you be in a your right mind and take away your pregnant girlfriend three points? Your eight months pregnant girlfriend, that makes sense to you? How you all live within yourself? And when the police them go for him, him have the audacity to cry. What you cry for? You don't have nothing for your cry about. 
Because I could never really see you just come to see where you are though. From your do it, you're supposed to come to reality long time. First, you say, I a baby mother this, and you should not do this to her, not only because of she, but because of your child that she is carrying. Big, big fathers there, and this bring down upon the fathers them. But see, a lot of fathers I say, you couldn't make the news stay until after Father's Day. To me, on opinion just sounds stupid. It's like say uno value the girl life. Like him could leave the girl alone. Why you never say that? What you mean by we leave the news until tomorrow because of Father's Day? Because no one look bad. I am pretty much sure her life did value more than this Father's Day where we are celebrate. That is just my view on it. All me I say, me just sorry the police them come so early. The police them should come so early because me know the people them are clearing down would have fixed him properly. Him better wash them policeman the foot. Him better praise them foot because them literally have to run the people them and I tell them say no, not today. For the people them go with them off a fire shot them off a wand with a bag of things for the people them back off and all when them do that them now back off because they want back off them are back off because nobody no want get hurt in the process you get what me i say so him big man me i tell you you know for go run on a prison cell you know for going on a waiting area you know for going on none of them something there them for just throw you out to the streets throw you out to the residence them them know what you deserve them know exactly what you've been do to the girl for a very long time the police them they know the police them they know you know so here we go on now at the residence them forget you at that me I agree with but i guess the police them they just do that because i them work them i do and they want to ensure say them carry in safe and so on and you get hurt under for them guard and also the fact say them want to do them investigation to make sure say you run them question and answer session and all of them look at something there. but me I tell you if I you do it I just start the police them come so early people when I remember say the residents them living at the community with them you know so them know the type of person him is them know him capable of you see if no little doubt did it I not think so much people would have come out and try to defend the girl I not think so much people would have hurt about the situation I not think so much people that left them big big Sunday dinner them big big father's day dinner and come out and try to do something about the situation it have to be a possibility say how you do it I am just can't understand, me can't figure out how you feel within yourself for she say you really do that to your girlfriend. How you feel, big man? This is like the second female, them baby father, do something like this to them. The second one. Viewers and subscribers, I know me a wait for now. I need to hear what are your thoughts on this story down in the comment section. We have made it to the end of our next video. Thank you guys for watching. Catch you guys next time. I'm out and stay blessed and stay safe.